Ryan D is EZP here today, guys. Today, super simple topic. We're talking about drive-by wire throttle bodies and cable throttle bodies. All right, guys, pretty simple topic today, just so people kind of know the terminology that's out there. So there is a there are two main types of throttle bodies you're gonna see on common vehicles. Uh, number one are cable throttle bodies. They're usually on older vehicles, not so much in modern vehicles as of this time. And then number two are drive-by wire throttle bodies. Basically, this is a mechanical versus electronic setup. The drive-by wire cars uh, do not have any sort of throttle that are directly connect your foot to the actual throttle body. Um, a lot of people don't like this because it says, oh, you don't feel it's connected to the car. There's a little bit of a delay in there, which sometimes there is. Um, and, and the car allows the car to modulate itself. You don't have full control over it. Nine times out of 10, it's not a worry. Um, as I'm sure like our LNF, LSJ guys know, you know, it's our LTG, Sonic, all pretty much modern vehicles that come by drive by wire, or even our series 330, ones. It's not, a, it's not a problem. The cars react fine. You get used to it. Um, and then especially with tuning, you know, the, you know, delays and things like that are taken out. Uh, so it's something where, you know, you pretty much, you'll get a throttle body, you'll plug the harness into it, and then that's how your vehicle is connected to that. Um, so that's very simple for the drive-by wire one. Uh, the cable throttle means that there's actually a cable setup that goes directly from the pedal to the actual throttle body. This is common on the Series 2 3800. I mean, obviously older vehicles and that, but usually more so the older vehicles. Um, this gives you a really connected feel to the car. Um, it's when you see people going under the hood and you know, f you know flipping the throttle body, they, they have a lever. That's Those are cable throttle cars. Um, those um, will allow you to say, go under your hood and rev your car for the most part. As well as, uh, it takes the PCM it takes the electronics out of the equation. So, you know, when you want to floor it, you know, you'll stay a while up and throttle. Um, and, you know, you don't have something trying to limit you or trying to limit you with traffic control or things like that. Um, so it's a very, it's a much more connected setup. Um, and some people actually really prefer the feel of them um, versus the drive by wire, which can, I say, have a few delays here and there. And for some people, it just doesn't have the connected feel. Just to kind of more so explain uh, why so many companies are using. Uh, drive-by-wire throttle bodies these days is for more control directly from the manufacturer. Um, so in the past, uh, with throttle cable cars, um, if the car wanted you to stop being, you know, frankly an asshole, you the only thing they can do is pull fuel and pull, pull timing. Um, where it can actually that can hurt an engine dip, given the right circumstance. Now, if you have a new car, uh, most PCMs are torque-based, and so what they can do is actually limit how much throttle the, uh, you're giving the car as well as kind of help you not stall the car like say in a manual car um, if you almost stall the car you let off too fast or you let the clutch out too fast and you don't give enough throttle the car will keep the throttle open so it doesn't stall itself it's just you know something from the fact that they can have a little more control over um, as well as try to save the life of the vehicles um, so if you're like constantly even driving down the road just kind of on off the throttle, just constantly, you know, giving it 100%, 0%, 100%, 0%, 0 you know, basically driving like an asshole. Uh, the car won't really let you do that. It'll kind of modulate the throttle, um, it, you know, to kind of keep it consistent for the vehicle. So, very simple one today, very easy to kind of go through. Cable throttle, physical, mechanical one that you, with your foot are opening and closing the throttle body. Drive by wire. Super simple, most modern cars, say 99% of modern cars have this, as, as well as it's an electronic part. That's it. All right, guys, as per usual, Ryan D is ZZP. If you have any questions, hit up customer services, if you need any sort of clarification. Have a good one, guys.